You have female children or all boys? I have three boys. You have three boys. Well, I hope that you, in your heart, don't hope that any of your three boys turn out to be like their father. I don't. Right? My first one plays soccer, so I know he's not going to be like that. And my younger two, they're not going to be like him. They're going to be better. Well, so. maybe they're going to be better. Not if you let him keep coming around. Right. Do you understand? Yes. It's not her fault that he's a piece of garbage. It's not her fault. So then why are you sending these nasty things? Because she posted nude pictures of me on social media way before I start okay. doing what I was so doing. So that's what we're talking about. Thank you. That's what we're talking about. So she posted mm -hmm. nude pictures of you. And officer. she also hacked Famous's Facebook and sent nude pictures of me to all his friends. Just a second. You have an answer? Yeah, I do. She's lying. Like, I have a police report right here. She had just recently hacked into... No, no, no. Pay careful attention to me. Okay. Is what you're telling me that you did not send nude pictures of her through social media? No, I didn't. Ever? Ever. Just a second. Can you prove to me that she posted these nude pictures of you on social media? The answer is either yes or no. Okay, no. Okay. You have one more, Miss Davenport. I've already explored two of your top three complaints. Now we're up to number three. Do you have a number three? Yes, when she stole my baby's ashes out of my house. What proof do you have that she did that? She sent text messages to my phone talking about, don't be surprised when you come home and your daughter's ashes isn't there. May I see the text message? Your Honor, I'm sorry that everything is all discombobulated. Yeah, just a, I, not just discombobulated. The only thing, we're on complaint number three, that she stole your baby's ashes from your house. I have over a thousand and some text messages from her. On what date were the ashes stolen? November 20th. What year? 2016. Did you get them back? I got them back. From whom? They was just left on my doorstep. Why would you send her that text? Because she had said, my dead brother, so I sent her that. Okay, good. Well, now you have, Miss Davenport, you have my attention with complaint number three, because that was a nasty thing to do. And considering that that was sent a month before the ashes were in fact taken, and then they were returned when? On the 23rd. They were returned three days later. Yeah. Was famous out of jail at that time? Yes, he was. Was he living with you? He wasn't staying with me, but he was there. What does that mean? He was, he was living with me. He was coming over to he my He was house. living he, with you. He had came back with me, and then I don't know about all that stealing ashes and all that, but you whatever. I know who did it because I've been having her ashes all this time, and then now that she no, popped that, up I, in the picture. I actually, Miss <laughs> Davenport, I believe that she probably took them. Now, how did she get into the house? She climbed through the window. How do you know that? Because the window was left open. May I see the police report on that? I climbed. I'm sorry, but... And he wasn't... I'm a big girl. Her window is, like, way high. How am I going to get up there? But okay. <laughs> Are you sure he didn't take them and hit and hide them from you? No, he wouldn't do that to me. Shh. Mm. Okay, you have a counterclaim. I'm going to hear it. Two seconds. This is messages between Letitia and another girl with Letitia asking her, where's my OBGYN? This is after I was served the restraining order. So if you're so scared of me and you have the restraining order, why are you coming to my kid's doctor's appointment with my kid's father, but you're so scared of me? This is messages between her and another girl when she was... Yeah, I see them. The blue is... The blue is Letitia and the white is the girl. You want to know something? Courts don't care about this. Courts don't care, actually, about either one of your problems. I'm just more concerned about my baby's ashes that she took from my house. That mm -hmm. destroyed me and my kids. Mm -hmm. And because of her constantly harassing me, coming to my house, setting my house on fire and everything, I, was, I had to move. Like, she had 15 females pull up to my house. Then she's, just a minute. Then she's an idiot. My kids. Then she's just a second. Safe. Then she's an idiot. And you're an idiot for having anything to do with this person who was currently incarcerated. You have young children at home. You're an idiot. Well, I you love should know him. better. What? I love him. You love him. Good, good. You know what I love? I love to be finished with this case. We're done. Your case is dismissed. It's over.